regarding the take home message um, regar about androgenic alopecia, I think we can say about few uh, main points. First, uh, now androgenic alopecia is a major problem in women and probably it's more of a therapeutic problem in women and we have a lot to offer now. Uh, but, and this is the first take home message that androgenic alopecia in women has to be diagnosed early because we are able to uh, halt or to stop the progress, the progression of the disease. And if it's diagnosed early, we have quite a lot to offer. Uh, one of the new developments is the use of um, uh, finasteride or even dutasteride in women. Uh, we use finasteride usually at a higher dose compared to men. Whereas in men, we use one milligram uh, per day. We use in women 2.5 or uh, five milligram per day. Uh, if it's not effective, we can go on to using dutasteride. I myself use 0.5 milligram per day. And uh, it has to be always kept in mind that both finasteride and dutasteride are teratogenic. So we have to be very cautious about this element. And then the second, I think, breakthrough in the treatment of uh, androgenic alopecia from actually this year, 2019, is the possibility of using uh, oral minoxidil. And most probably oral minoxidil will be significantly more effective compared to topical minoxidil. It's not available yet, but there's a lot of scientific data which show that this may be a high uh, promise for future.